Jackie doesn't know what to do about her homework. She is facing a very difficult math problem. Jackie's been given this problem that she needs to solve. 4x squared y times the quantity 3xy minus 2x squared plus 4x. She isn't sure how to work with this problem. Do you know? This problem involves a monomial being multiplied by a polynomial. Jackie thinks it has something to do with the distributive property, but she's not quite sure. Do you remember the distributive property? The distributive property is helpful whenever you have a term outside of parentheses, and then you have terms inside parentheses, like this one, 4x minus 3. You can use the distributive property to simplify this expression by multiplying the term outside by both of the terms inside. In this case, we would multiply 2 times 4x, and we would get 8x. And we would multiply 2 times a negative 3, which would give us a negative 6. And now this expression is simplified. Jackie's actually right. You can use the distributive property to multiply a monomial by a polynomial. Let's take a look at the problem again that she was puzzled by. We have 4x squared y times the quantity 3xy minus 2x squared plus 4x. Now if we're going to use the distributive property, we're going to take this term and we're going to be multiplying it by each of the terms inside the parentheses. So we can say 4x squared y times 3xy minus 4x squared y times 2x squared plus 4x squared y times 4x. Now you can see we've distributed this 4x squared y. It's here, it's here, and it's here. Now we can multiply each term. Let's start with this first one. 4x squared y times 3xy. We can start with the numbers. We multiply 4 times 3. We get 12 x squared times x is x cubed. y times y is y squared. Now we have our first term. Here's a subtraction. Let's bring it down. And now let's work on this second term. 4 times 2 gives me 8. x squared times x squared gives me x to the fourth. And then there's just a y in this first one not here, so we bring down the y. Bring down the plus, and we have 4x squared y times 4x. 4 times 4 is 16. x squared times x is x to the third. Bring down the y. Our final answer is 12x cubed y squared minus 8x to the fourth y plus 16x cubed y.